Shalom, shalom, and welcome back to the channel. This is just a quick little video I wanted to do for you guys. If you're going to be observing the Day of Atonement this coming Saturday, September 23rd at sundown, then this video is for you. So I wanted to come on here really quickly just to kind of do a little bit of encouragement for you ladies and myself, <laughs> and myself. Um, to get into the mode of Day of Atonement and kind of do a prep. So I am going to be throwing up a fast um, and I'd love for you ladies to join me. Let's, you know, as many women that can fast together and, you know, praise the Most High together, the Most High will hear our prayers even more. Um, I have seen so many messages come out of my last week's video, um, you know, about the anger spirit. So I think that this would be great for a lot of you guys and me included <laughs> to throw up a fast, to make sure that we are in order, to make sure that we are winning these spiritual battles because the, the, the spirits have been, has been descend, they are descending. They are, however you want to say, they have been unleashed um, onto all of us that are following the law, statutes and commandments. So if you felt like it's a little bit more a strife going on or you've been a little bit kind of you know just eh, just not as righteous as you really want to be then it's definitely the best to always fast and pray all these spirits off of you so please join me um in doing this fast uh it is going to begin tomorrow i'm gonna throw up uh, my own fast but i want you guys to join me tomorrow um, which is going to be wednesday evening that's going to run through sabbath so wednesday evening to thursday evening thursday evening to friday evening and then go ahead and eat your food on friday and all of saturday for the sabbath because the sabbaths are high holy days so it's not best to fast on those days then the day of atonement comes in saturday evening through sunday evening so if this is your first time fasting or you're not used to fasting then between Wednesday to Friday night, then throw up a one day fast like for 24 hours. If you can do those two full days, fantastic. If you're used to fasting and you want to fast longer, then start tonight. You know, start right after you eat dinner tonight from Tuesday night to Wednesday night, Wednesday night to Thursday night, Thursday night to Friday night, and then you cut it off. Please remember too um, that uh, you're fasting so you can still go ahead and prep. You know, go ahead and get your stuff for Sabbath still worn out you know, still do what you, you know, need to do. It says in the book of Matthew that you are not to, you know, act like you're fasting, you know, so please, you know, wash yourself, anoint oil onto your head and still kind of go around uh, doing your day's errands. So still prep your food, cook your food so you can be ready to eat because we cannot cook, obviously, on Sabbath on Friday night once the sun goes down. So just wanted to kind of go ahead and put this out there, you know, during this time as well, another thing I wanted to say is if there's anything that's on your mind that you think that should be resolved, go ahead and try to resolve it. You know, we want to make sure that this is taken very seriously. The Day of Atonement is a very high, holy day. All of them are important, but this is a really good one because this gives you the time to finally repent. If you haven't thrown up a fast before, this is the one that you really want to take seriously. And again, like I said, prep even before that to make sure you're not bringing any leaven, any spiritual leaven into the day of atonement so make sure that you're forgiving make sure that you're trying to get yourself in order make sure that you're reconciling things with people um and just kind of you know getting your spirit right ladies let's get our spirit right so that's it i just wanted to kind of encourage you guys I'm not pulling any scriptures or anything just want to encourage you guys to throw up a fast with me um and uh and you know let's get our let's get ourselves ready let's make this a really good day of atonement right down um, things that you want to atone for that always helps me as well you know just a couple little short little lists of things you want to make sure you atone for so on the day of atonement that you know you have a really good one on Friday I'll give you some on my Sabbath video I'll give you some prayers that are in the book of Psalm that are really good to pray on the day of atonement if you you know if this is like your first time or if you want to you know kind of make it a little bit deeper um, I'll give you some prayers that I also do as well that we really kind of bring out them tears <laughs> It really kind of helps you really get you know contrite like you should be. So that's it, ladies. Um, have a good day, and hopefully, um, you I'll hear you you know read you guys comments and uh, also emails from you guys that you're going to be joining me in this fast. All right, shalom.